Hey guys, what is going on? It is your friendly neighborhood Zebraman. We're here with our WW12 Universe mode, one week away from Unforgiven. I actually can't believe it. We've already gotten through these few weeks, and I'm very excited for Unforgiven. I can't wait to stream it, it's going to be so fun. So I want to get this week over and done with as fast as we can and get to Unforgiven to play all the matches that's going to happen then. So, what I thought we'd do is. I know you guys have been reading the comments, I just haven't been able to reply to them because I've, ve I've been very busy lately. So, um, the idea I had was I didn't want to do a number one contenders match for the United States Championship between with MVP and whoever because I honestly don't think MVP is ready yet. I think he needs to start a rivalry up, but I don't think he's ready for that title yet. I think there are many other people out there. That deserves the title, but he just he isn't even popping up on the rankings like so. I don't think he deserves a shot yet. So this is gonna be a two on three tag team. This is gonna be cool now. So we're gonna have us as MVP. And we are gonna be tagging up with we'll just go original. Nope. We're gonna be tagging up with none other than Doink the Clown. Where are you at Doink? And now just wait for doing to load. We're gonna be going against the same opponents as last week, except they're gonna have one man extra. We got Kofi Kingston, John Cena. Mhm. Mm uh, yeah, purple attire. So, and we're not gonna be Sheamus. It's gonna be a random superstar, but it has to be a raw superstar. I know Doink is smacked. Well, Kane, whatever. So we get Kane, John Cena, Kofi Kingston, and we're with Doink. I hope that's correct. Let me check. It should be. Yeah, that was right. MVP, no. Doink, John Cena, Kofi, and Kane. This is going to be painful. We haven't picked John Cena's other attire. This is going to be painful. Hopefully we can create a few rivalries with this. We're not going to watch all the entrances because that will be a pain. So hopefully this will be good. I know I say hopefully a lot, but I've got good hopes for the match. If we win this match, we could be going places. And I was I was actually looking at the um, the superstars, momentum and stuff before the match. Just not these superstars in particular, but um, other superstars like, you know, the WWE Champion Big Show. I was looking at him and he... He's got so much momentum. He's keeping the title at Unforgiven. And that's what I want to talk about as well. Who's going to be keeping their titles at Unforgiven? I'm, I'm not sure. I'm Actually, you know what? Triple H, I think he's keeping his title, title at Unforgiven. I know he's injured and all, but he's one of those characters in this game that's just a momentum machine. They'll just pick up momentum so fast. And oh, we nearly got the kick on Kofi there. But he's one of those momentum machines. He can just get the momentum and keep the momentum for so long that's why I believe he will stay heavyweight champion and it, it just won't move from him unless we move it from him and it's great to see that Tajiri is facing Wade Barrett but knowing that I hope that Tajiri is the new intercontinental champion at Unforgiven that's what I'm hoping because I think that would be amazing if Tajiri is the intercontinental champion and that means we've already got someone with a title in our universe mode which is it, it's amazing I think that we're doing so well so fast. Like Tajiri is he's a pretty good wrestler in this and hopefully MVP can get on the status. I, I don't want it to be the case. Well it would it'd be nice to see that MVP gets a shot for the um the WWE championship. That'd be pretty awesome. You know, instead of getting to the United States he creates a rivalry with Kane or John Cena. I keep doing the Irish whip, I'm so sorry. He gets a rivalry with Kane or John Cena and they're like number one contenders. You know, and he he could do good, you know. We're kind of dominating Kofi now. But yeah, that's what I believe. Kofi, on the other hand, actually, I never spoke about him. I think he's got the potential to keep his title. I was looking at the contenders. There's Michael McGiddy-Cuddy, Dolph Ziggler, and Goldust. Now, the case is... I I feel that um, if, it, if he was facing Michael McGiddy-Cuddy, he could easily win that match. But if he was facing Dolph Ziggler... It's a different story. I don't think he, he might get lucky and win with Dolph Ziggler, but I don't know. That's what I'm thinking. What are your guys' predictions for this pay-per-view after seeing it over the coming weeks? Who do you think is going to be the um, the champions? Who's going to keep the titles? Who's going to win the titles as well? 
actually I've come to think of it I'm gonna by Friday um, you should have the rankings for who's going I should have a video up saying who's going to Unforgiven and what are the matches that are gonna be scheduled and it will be streamed which is awesome if I can get my stream and working oh god we're in the corner now here comes full moves of doom John Cena here he goes come on John Cena let's do it four moves of doom you can't do it I think we're gonna need to tag and doink the clown come on let's do this oh John Cena John Cena the whole crowd is screaming we love Cena not really I can't wait for WWE 13 come to think of it WWE 13 looks so good I, I know I'm gonna say this and the game might be good I actually think this game was pretty good like I enjoyed the universe mode I really did but I, I don't know what it is I just love the whole universe mode idea like in uh, Smackdown vs. Raw 2011 Jesus I swear I have a stutter or something but in the Smackdown vs. Raw 2011 um, I played 18 years of universe now you might say that is sad but I just found it that fun and I wouldn't say I played half as much and I, I wouldn't even play I haven't even played that much of universe in this game but um WWE 13 the physics in the game looks awesome you know the predator technology and stuff like that you know I, I really like that that's I think that's pretty awesome the, the pin roll-ups you saw Robert bowling uh, I said Robert bowling <laughs> what a fail Robert bowling the the Modern Warfare, former Modern Warfare 3 community manager. I should have said Corey Ledesma. Jesus Christ. Jesus Christ. I should give up YouTube now when I have the chance. <laughs> anyway. Yeah, Corey Ledesma put out gameplay of it. And it looks pretty good. Like mid air finishers, you know. Enemies, uh, opponents jumping off top rope. And what a kick there. Jumping off top rope reverse and go to sleep you know CM Punk or attitude adjustment John Cena but let's do this let's kick John Cena's ass on the knee hopefully we can get a signature or a finisher or something throw him out of the ring here we go boom slam on his back pick him up this is it John Cena oh reversal machine reversal machine we gotta get some revenge you know even though we did win last week we still gotta beat his ass even more and I, I was thinking back on S SmackDown, I can't believe we actually injured Triple H. Uh, that's, a, that's a big feat, you know, to injure Triple H. And then we've already got Wade Barrett injured. If I'm correct, Wade Barrett is injured, which is crazy. He's injured the two champions on SmackDown. But here we go. Signature. How do I do the signature? He's not, he has to be on the mat. Oh, crap. Not today, Cena. Not today. I'm doing the reversals here today. Okay, there wasn't a wake up taunt, there wasn't a wake up taunt. Reverse, oh god, oh god, oh god. Glitches. And oh my god, Cena! Cena! Hit the Dez Press! This is gonna be interesting. Oh, he's punching us, he's punching. Oh god, come on, we can do the finisher. Oh my god, four moves of doom. It's coming, it's coming. Oh crap. I think we need to get a hot tag. Come on, Doink. Do something to get us a hot tag. Oh, crap. How do we go from in the driver's position to this? Oh, God. Five moves of doom. Here it comes. Don't see five knuckle shuffle. No? Oh. Come on. We can do this. We can do this. Here we go. Here we go. Oh, we reversed it. Reversal machine. John Cena's going to do it. He's going to do it. No, not today, John Cena. Not today. Not today. Boom. Jumping complete shot. Not today. John Cena. On the knee. Oh, I should have gone for the cover, but I don't think Doink can take out two of them. One, two. And Cena kicks out. Cena kicks out. Cena kicks out the moves. Yeah. Come on, Doink. Do something. Do something, Doink. Jump in the ring. Come on, Doink, do something. Jump in the ring. God damn it. God damn it. God damn it. Here we go. Slam you on your back. And oh, he's got his finisher. What's up, bros? Okay, here we go now. Boom, on his back. 
taunt this bitch out. Taunt this bitch out. Where's Doink? Where the hell is Doink? Oh my god. Kane. Yeah, Tombstone. This is not looking good. Dear god. Kane, you're not finishing it here? No? You're not finishing it? No? He doesn't want to finish it. That was a mistake you shouldn't have made. Oh my god, Kane. You could have ended it there. Alright, we're getting Doink in this. Doink is coming into this. Come on, Doink. Doink is gonna do some damage. Next WWE champion, Doink. Here we go. I'm gonna do some damage outside the ring. Kofi Kingston. Kofi Kingston needs a bit of lessons, don't you? Now, this should also bring up um, Doink's momentum. Yeah, hopefully we can get rid of Kofi Kingston. Because um, he seems to have the most um, stamina or health. Oh, it's gone now. Now John Cena, which there's an announce table here that has your name on it. Hope you enjoy going through this. Send John Cena on the knee. This is it, John Cena. We could probably lose the match being out here. John Cena's just throwing us into the, the ring barricade like it's nothing. You know, trying to keep into the match, you know, for his fans. But not today, John Cena. Not today. Oh, and through the announce table. Oh my god, MVP. Don't like with the bear hug. Don't like with the bear hug. Alright, Cena. Not today. Sorry, Cena. Oh no. Shit. <laughs> Cena's just kicking their ass now. Come on, we can do this. Come on, Cena. Not today. Come on. You're not getting up on the ropes. Okay, maybe he is. He just dropped you on your face. Oh. God damn. He's just dancing on top of us. Okay, Kane is probably going to take out Doink. I guess definitely see an unforgiven match between these two. Boom. On the face. And over this way. Boom. On his back. It's going to be epic. Okay. Now into the chairs. Into these chairs. <laughs> All right. Alright, Cena, I want to put you into the steps, even though we're so badly hurt. Into the steps. Okay, I'm so bad at the aiming in this. Into the steps. Okay. Here we go. Back in the ring. Don't might need a hot tag, even though we're dead. Oh, Kane. Okay. Come here. Kane, come here. Doink's got the finisher, does he? No. Kane, no, I don't know. Kane, come here. Okay. Oh, I can't do a submission. I'm not tagged in. Dropkick. I can actually do a finisher, though, if I am correct. Go on, Doink. Hit him with the finisher. Don't count us out, ref. We're going to lose. As we're lying down. Oh, Doink. Doink, come on. Nice oh, reversal. shitty reverse finisher. Oh, and Doink reversed it again. This is getting really interesting. And did Kane. Kane. Oh my god. How do I do a hot tag? Oh no, Doink reverse. Doink reverses it. Doink is going for the finisher. Oh no 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 I didn't mean it I didn't mean it I didn't mean it shit he's he's gonna have the finisher he's oh my god Doink put him to sleep put him to sleep Doink put him to sleep neck breaker no that wasn't it oh shit Bob moves to Doom Cena stay outside the ring people stay out Kofi. Oh, and Kobe keeps us in the head. John Cena picking up the steps, trying to be a boss, trying to show off his strength, even though they're plastic. Oh, look, look at Kofi. Giving shit to the announcers. Take that. 
Come on, you can do this. And those left hands have just done so much damage. Oh shit, come on, Doink. Skinner. Do your finisher for fuck's sake. That's not it. Dude, it's just don't bring him around the ring. Alright, this is it, isn't it? And there's the submission, this might be it. No. Whoa. God damn it, Doink. You look at this? You're gonna you make this upload this so difficult for me. Isn't that your plan, Doink? Just go for the goddamn cover. Well, let's tag, tag me in. Tag me in. Tag me in, Doink. I'm just gonna drop for the pin straight away. Alright, jump in. Okay. Oh, I got a comeback moment, though. You sure? They don't care. Kofi, get off me! You're not, you're not allowed to be in the ring. What the? Where did my comeback go? Oh, I have to be on the ground, don't I? Oh shit! Oh shit! I'm not using my resiliency. Go on, Doink. Go on. Oh shit! Choke slam. Not today. You're not choke slamming, Doink. Come back. Ball in. Here we go. Get up. Get up. Oh my god. Choke slam. This is not turning out good for us, Kane. Why you do that, Kane? Why you do that? Okay, resiliency. Not today. Not today, Kane. Here we go. Boom. And whoa, we're under the crowd now. What's going on? Rope. <laughs> I can't, I can't, I just, I'm, ah, there we go, jeez, <laughs> what the hell, <laughs> we're looking at a woman's ass in this, okay, come on, one, two, three, Kane is pinned, I think John Cena was pinned, we've definitely pinned Kofi Kingston anyway, or, we put him through a table at least, so I think we've pinned all of them, so yeah, we're awesome, and this video is going to be like a 20 minute video, it's gonna take me like eight hours to render and like eight hours to upload it. But whatevs, whatevs, okay? Whatevs. It doesn't matter anymore. Anyway, we might just skip on to SmackDown. Rankings, have they changed? No. Do you see what I see? Do you see what I see? Because what I see is MVP is the second motherfucking contender for the WWE Championship. Hands in the air, people. Hands in the air. I was like, we're not worthy for the United States Championship. We're not worthy yet. But what did we do? We got to the WWE Championship. This could be the most successful universe mode ever. Okay. So, hmm. Tajiri doesn't have a match tonight, should we give him off? I don't know. Anyway, I've been Mr. Zeverman. Until the next time, I keep fucking up this intro. Okay, I'm gonna say this right now. Okay. Until next time, I've been Mr. Zeverman. Peace.